So Cecil, of all of those silly cold opens that we've done, what is your personal favorite? Mm, probably the one where I punch you in the face. Bienvenidos, straight fans. Welcome to the Horror Show. I'm Jaime in Fuego. And I'm Cecil Laird, and we're here to present uh, the first of what'll likely be a multiple episode series that'll just take time to build up, because what we're going to do is show you some of our favorite cold opens that we've done for a lot of our reviews so far. We just started doing cold opens a lot more regularly about six months ago, and... We've done some fun ones. Yes, we and have. And I'm willing to bet that some people have skipped some because they haven't been a fan of that movie or whatever. So we thought this was a good way to showcase what we've done creatively with the cold open. Some are just kind of throwaway jokes. Others are actual things that I put some, you know, production value into and stuff like that. Joke so, <laughs> Yeah, so it, it's fun. And um, we thought we'd uh, present them to you guys. So this is episode one of our Cold Open Compilations. Make sure I'm kinda lit. You're lit. Lit as fuck. This whole show is lit! <laughs> Alright, well that's clearly the cold this. open. <laughs> So guys, I gotta ask you, what is the best Gremlins copycat that came after that film became big? My vote's for Ghoulies. No, 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 no. Munchies. Hmm? Ah, guys, come on, let's get real here. Clearly, the best knockoff of Gremlins, even if it was lacking a bit in the humor department, was obviously Critters. Bienvenidos, straight fans. Welcome to the horror show. I'm Jaime and Fuego. I'm Cesar von Slaughter. Crike infestation detected. Dude, what's wrong with you? Kill Krites. What does that mean? What the? Hey man, did you ever think it's safe to go back into the water, but not into the woods? No. No, no, definitely not. Way more dangerous to go in the water. You might be wrong. Doubt it. Okay guys, we saw what happened in the comments section of our Lords of Chaos trailer reaction. We're about to do the review, so let's be prepared. Ready? Shields up. Here we go. <laughs> Greetings, everyone, and welcome to another edition of A, A Star, Star is, is Born, Born in, in Gore! gore. That's right, and today on A Star is Born in Gore, we ask what current day millionaire heartthrob got their start in the 1991 installment of the cult favorite creature feature franchise, Critters 3, and as always, buzz in with your name. Fuego! Fuego, go ahead. Was it Jennifer Aniston? Ooh, no, I'm sorry. That was a totally oh. different furry little killer, the uh. Leprechaun. <laughs> Susie, go ahead. Simple. It's Leonardo Di motherfucking Caprio. That's right, Susie. Yes. Josh, tell her what she's won. Absolutely nothing. Oh, ah. son of a bitch. Hey, everyone. Welcome to the horror show. I'm Susie Von Slaughter. And I'm Jaime and Fuego. Oh, my God. God, Marsha! Are you okay? Uh, yeah, I'm fine. I just kind of woke up like this. Marsha, I'm pretty sure you have stigmata. The what?
Something's really wrong here. Greetings, everyone, and welcome to yet another edition of A Star is Born in Gore! And today we are asking which bit of current Hollywood royalty had one of their earliest acting experiences in the Let's Set It in Space entry of the classic creature franchise, Critters 4. Oh, oh! Susie. Oh, was it... Halle Berry. No, no, I'm sorry, but you were close. Halle Berry did play Storm in the X-Men, which is clearly a role that this actress should have been given. Fuego, do you have an answer? I got this one. That's a pre-groove Stella herself, Angela Bassett. That's right. Hey. Way to go, Fuego. Now, tell him what he's won, Josh. A punch in the face. Wait, what? <laughs> Hey everyone, welcome to The Horror Show, I'm Cecil Laird. I'm Ian Fuego here. And I'm Russia. What was that? I heard it too. I don't know what you guys are talking about. No, I'm pretty sure someone's barking at the moon, bro. <laughs> no, no, it's nothing. Everything's fine, everything's just fine. <sighs> That was Beavis. <laughs> How does he do it again? <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Can we just keep this? We just saw Wolf Creek. <laughs> we saw Wolf Creek. Hey, Fuego. What's up? You know, your mom is so fat that when she fell, no one laughed, but the ground cracked up. Hey, Susie, you know, your mom is so ugly that One Direction went the other way. <laughs> well, at least my mama didn't fuck a critter. Oh. Guys, what do both of you want to review these today? Oh, I don't know. How about... Hello there, poils and cools. Joker here, just reminding you to stay scared out there and always go out with a smile. 